Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Jewel Tolentino. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to add and install new fonts on Camtasia for free. All right, so you see this text right here? It says, hello, my name is Jewel. And the font looks really cool, right? Well, it's a font called Alien Encounters, and that is not a font that comes with Camtasia. I had to download that, install it, and then have it installed into Camtasia so that I could use it as normal, as, as any other font. So let me show you how to do that. First, you want to head over to Google, and you want to find free fonts. So we need to just type in free fonts. And one of the first few ones that are going to come up is 1001freefonts.com and defont.com. Those are kind of the two main ones, and I generally go for 1001freefonts.com. So we're going to click on that, and you can see that they have a whole bunch of different kind of fonts. They'll have ones already, you know, listed on here. But here you can go through and choose a category or a theme of fonts. Let's say you want fire. Let's, let's see what fire fonts look like. All right, cool. So we've got some cool looking fonts here. Another cool thing is if you want to test out the font, you can actually type here into the preview and it will put whatever you typed in that font. So I can put my name and click update. And then you can see my name is now in each of the fonts. So you can see what the font looks like in the text that, that you were thinking of. So all these look kind of cool. Actually, this is giving me an idea for a video. This one right here. If I got this and then got some fire stock footage, that would probably actually look really cool. All right, so let's actually do this one because I am going to grab some of that fire stock footage and just play around a bit here. So I want to use, I want this font and I'm going to click download. It's going to start downloading and there's like a zip file here. You want to get this zip file onto your desktop. So what I'm doing here is I'm just minimizing the screen and then I'm going to drag the zip file onto my desktop. From here, I'm going to right click on this file and I'm going to click extract all. It's going to ask you if you want to extract it and you're going to say yeah. And then it's going to give you a folder that pretty much looks the same but without the zipper. So it's been unzipped. And then you just want to go into that folder. And then from here, you're going to see the font name. This is the name of the font. You just want to right click on it. And then go to install. Once you do that, the font is going to be installed onto your computer. So when you open anything that uses fonts like Word document, Camtasia, Photoshop, anything that uses fonts from your computer, it's now going to be installed in there. So I essentially just installed this onto my computer, which will install it onto Camtasia. Now I've got Camtasia open and I just installed a font. For the, f the new free font to show up, I need to exit out of Camtasia and then reopen the software so that it's going to be in the new updated one. So I, I can't, um, the font is not sh gonna show up here. So I need to exit and then come back and open it and then the new font will come in. All right, so I've just reopened Camtasia. I exited out of it and then I just reopened it. And now I'm going to go to the fonts again and scroll through and find the name of that font. It started with the G and here it is right there. You just need to scroll down and find the name of the actual font. So this was the font right here and I'm going to click on that and you can see that this is the new font. It was not on here previous and I got it for free, downloaded it from that site and then installed it. And just for fun, I said that I would add some fire stock footage. So let me quickly grab that. All right, so I've just uploaded the fire stock footage to the media bin. So let's drag it down and put it to this font because I just, that's what happens sometimes is I just, 
get random ideas by searching things. So in seeing that fire font, I thought it'd be cool to put fire behind it. So let's do that right now. And you want to put it below the font so that it is behind it and it sort of sees through. And let me see if I can change the font to black. And I think I want to delete all this other text and just have my name. And let's enlarge this. So you see the font size, it seems like it only goes up to 256, but that's just how far the dial goes. If you just highlight it and you type in a number, it'll go higher. I think the highest is 500. Let me see. 600 no the highest is 500 and look how cool that looks at 500 size font fire font with my name and now let's just play it and it's like whoa that looks pretty epic and that's just a random idea that i got from doing this tutorial video this was not planned and things happen like that when you just get inspired so that is how you install new fonts for free on Camtasia. If you like these kinds of videos, I have a nine plus hour Camtasia course. It's got over 70 lectures. If you wanna fast track your Camtasia learning, I highly recommend you check it out. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.